fresh and clean Hello, hi everyone. You're most welcome to one of the best shows around town. This is Fresh and Clean, and it's hosted by yours truly, Sheba Ejo, for the Nigerian princess slash Ugandan princess. Now, when I Uganda, I am yours truly. Well, this show airs every Saturday from 11 to 12:30 with I repeat on Tuesday, 10 to 11:30, only on 24 television. We have the Afrobaba app, the Airtel TV app, the YouTube app that is available you can always download them subscribe make sure you subscribe share it all your friends and leave a comment down there instagram is at fresh and clean tiktok fresh and clean when you have some when you're watching us and then you're like ah, i want to record a video while watching fresh and clean you can drop it at tiktok's fresh and clean or you tag us and then we'll be able to post you well if you're wondering where the rest of the team is at they traveled out of uganda and they decided to leave me since i went to egypt in July, half is a baby Muluma. So, um, this week has been filled with, with a bit of drama, and the drama president, since he joined the entertainment industry, he has been in the news back to back, back to back. Alien Skin. I, for one, I love Alien Skin. I don't know why you guys keep bashing him. You keep, I don't know, but. So Alien Skin was in the news with Abitex because he cancelled the Inquacha Festival. For all those who know, the first Inquacha Festival, I think it was happening on the 27th of this very month and he cancelled it. And he says even the rest that were going to happen, he cancelled them because him and the promoter or Abitex, they couldn't come to terms, they couldn't agree on one or two things. So Abitex declares that he's taking him to court. He needs his money that he paid the TV ads and then the places that he had booked, some of the places that had already booked them. So he wants the money back. And then leaving that aside, oh my God, Cristiano Ronaldo hit 600 million on Instagram and he's the very first person to have the most followers on Instagram with 600 million. I think Instagram at this point they need to start paying him because imagine someone having all those followers. Meanwhile I don't even follow him. I know other people don't follow him but how many people are in this world that guy only has 600 million on Instagram. I thought the Kardashians were some of the most followed celebrities but my own surprise it's Cristiano Ronaldo the beloved footballer. And then putting that aside, Mark Zuckerberg and Elon Musk, I don't know when that battle is going to end. One is from Twitter, another one is from Meta. They keep going back and forth, going back and forth. But I think even the problem is when two wealthy people come together, unplanned kidding or wing it as far as we just have to use the apps. And then whoever wins wins. So um later uh, in the beginning of this week. Mark Zuckerberg stated that he wants a fight with Elon Musk in the cage. For all those who know fights, fights like the ones of Mayweather, those ones, Benjo Gelako. So Mark Zuckerberg said he wants to go face to face with Elon Musk so that the feud can come to an end. And then, of course, Elon Musk says, no, I cannot go into that. I thought it would be vice versa. I thought it would be like maybe Elon Musk is getting the fight, but my own surprise, it's Mark Zuckerberg. So let's wait and see if, if, if they agree. I know that that fight is going to bring money to any person who decides that they're going to sponsor it. It's going to bring money. It's going to be the most talked about thing this very year because Mark Zuckerberg says he wants it this year. So, um... We are in August, of course. When we, when we, when we get into August, it's a time for spending money. Send the two hours. Yeah, we didn't miss a Jesus. I could leave August, September, October, November. So I have a, a certain event that I'm going to put you guys onto. It's at Nyungyamawe Forest Park. I think most of you know that place. So it's ho it's hosting the Ndeko and Nyamachomo Festival, and they're inviting each and every one. Tax is just fifty thousand, and then thirty k. If you want to come through, please come through and party with us. That's from the 27th, that's from the 25th of August to the 27th of August. Come, let's have fun and we eat some meat. We take some nice photos. We slam night. Life is too short to sit at home. So some birthdays that we are having this very month. Happy birthday to all the, to all the August babies. Happy birthday to Salvatore. Hmm? 
Salvatlana, Salvatlana, that's from Emma. She sa he says happy birthday to you, darling. And then aside him, happy birthday to Sally Alpha, that's from Hafizo. Happy birthday to gift may your new age be filled with fruits and blessings for your house. That's from Happy. Lots of love. Happy, I'm very happy. I'm wishing happy birthday. One message is even change. So happy birthday to each and everyone. We wish you all the best and blessed new age. We're going to go in for a short musical break. When we come back, we'll be discussing that and more on this very show, fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. All right, welcome back from that short musical break. Like I told you guys, as I was starting, we have the Mark Zuckerberg and Elon Musk fight. Who are you supporting? Leave us a comment on our Instagram and tell us who do you think is going to win and who has more money. Of course, money comes first. And this is a top three movie picks picked by yours truly, Sheba Ijofo. Um, a lot of movies are being released since it's, it's almost the end of the year. Um, so people are rushing to release all those 2023 re releases. Our number three is The Perfect Find. The Perfect Find is a very, very, very nice movie. For those who have not yet watched it, please make sure you watch it. Um, it has stars. It has stars like Keith, Keith Powers. It has Gabriel Union. It's a very nice movie. So this movie is about falling in love. You understand? Uh, everything is at stake for a 40-year-old woman. Her career had her ticking biological clock and her bank account she's running broke and she's turning 40 she doesn't have she doesn't have a job and she has no love life so she try she risks it all for an intense secret romance with one with one person who could destroy her entire comeback you know imagine you getting a, a job and then you fall in love with your boss's son understand and your boss is a female you know how females are they don't like such things of like being in one place and then you're dating someone they know of so and now this is the mother so this movie it's it it's produced by the gabriel union herself for all those who know her she has been she's been great she's a good actress imagine she's acting like a 20 a, a 40 year old woman but in actual life she's even older than 40 you understand and she's acting with someone who is younger than her in real life like She's a good actress, so let's watch its trailer. And this movie is from Netflix. Let's have its trailer. We'll be coming back with our number two. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Yes, and our number two is the generation, the generation pod or the pod generation. So you know the generation we are in, everyone has a phone, everyone is on the internet and there are so many, so many things that have changed like our grandparents, they never used to do. For instance, our, gran our, gran our grandparents, but of late I can pay someone and they get pregnant on my behalf. Like so many things have changed. The tradition we are used to is no longer available. So I don't know what we are going to do with that kind of living that we are in right now. So the poor generation is not it's about in the not so distant future amid a society madly in love with technology a tech giant pegasus offers the couples the opportunity to share their pregnancies via detachable artificial wombs or pods so here you share your pregnancy with something artificial i don't know how this would do it but let me tell you by the time we will reach to give birth so this movie it's 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 directed by Sophie Bathers and it's not a Netflix movie this time around. Let's have a trailer. We'll be coming back with our number three. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Yes, and our number three movie pick, it's called The Shortcomings. It's about a struggling California maker who contemplates his romantic future when his girlfriend moves to New York City for an internship. I know why all these movies are about someone struggling and then they don't have a love life. I mean, for us at 19 or 17, in Uganda, people have love life. So, yeah, Gamba, me, the person I'm with, and I'm moving from Biram. For them, they're struggling with their careers. I think we need to find something better to do guys so this movie it was released on 4th august it's a very very nice movie let's have its trailer we'll be coming back with the countdown Fresh and clean. 
Fresh and clean Fresh and clean Yes, we have come to the top five picks, the music picks, and it's picked by me. I don't know what you guys are going to say, but please tell me. This I've been listening to a certain song, I think, this entire week. It's an artist that I hadn't discovered yet, but she's great. When I tell you this artist is good, she's like her music. I think most of you are now starting to hear more about her. So she has a song which I'm giving her number five today. It's called Love Story. I love this song. I love this song to death. So I dedicate it to each and everyone who is in love. I dedicate it to each and everyone out there who is struggling to find love. You're going to find love as you're listening to this song. So our number five is Love Story. That's by Laika Music. And our number four is Upendo by Virota. Virota, Virota, Virota is a very good artist, you guys. His, his lyrics, even when he's in the music video, how he, how he resonates with the, the, what he's singing about, it makes you believe like this guy has maybe suffered a, suffered a heartbreak like when he's recording that. So I think this guy is very good. And to my, to my surprise, I think he's 19 or 20, but his music is very, very good. So number five is like a music is love story and then virotas will pendle let's go in with the number five and number four will be coming back with the rest of the countdown fresh and clean fresh and clean and then our number three, it's Influencer by Fefe Busi. Influ, influ, influencer by Influencer Mulibanji, mostly ku TikTok. Nye mutu wabi, yalu mutu jia kuata Influencer to Mokuwe. Mwe. And people, you need to be careful on the things you guys you learn from, the people you learn from on the social media platforms. Because someone comes on social media, they fake their entire life story and you guys are picking a leaf or you guys are learning something of which... Ah, you guys, the influencers on social media, no, 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 the, the work you guys are doing, I think the only influencer that I can put my hand up for is Sheila Gashumba. Oh my God, her influence is so good. Girl is good. Girl is good. So you guys, you need to follow her. So our number three is Influencer by Fefe Bossi and our number two is Tone Sovola by Queen Sheba. Queen Sheba has a concert coming up. Um, Queen Sheba versus King's King Cinderella Sanyo. Tugenda lava ni anachi tuwala fe. Tuli wano, me I use an iPhone, but I've, I've never used a Nokia in my life. Oh, no, I've never used a Nokia. I thought even my, my button phone is a Nokia, but it's a techno. So let's wait and we see. So let's have our number three and number two. We'll be coming back with our bonus track, number one. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Yes, before I give you guys my bonus track and the number one, there is a song for Feb uh, sorry, there's a song that Alien Skin Al Alien Skin released in the midst of this week. I, I don't know the song, but the only parts that I know in that song, symbol in balance. You guys <laughs> I die, I die every time I just hear symbol in balance. Don't just don't sing for me the rest or don't put the rest, just put for me the part symbol in balance. Like what does it even mean? Oh god, you guys I love Alien Skin to death. That guy is good and he really he releases his music back to back. Mubam cha symbol and balance now apparently is another song. Cut you guys. I love Alien Skin so much. So our bonus track is Believe Me That's by John Drill and Don Jazzy. This song is good. Don Jazzy guys. I had forgotten Don Jazzy sounds good. Like I had forgotten this guy has good good like a good voice. He has good vocals. So Bonus track is Believe Me John Drilly and Don Jazzy and then our number one is by the the big man himself, Big Seven, Banner Boy. Oh Banner Boy is good. Banner Boy is giving us good music though this year but they a bit a bit calm compared to last year. But still his music is good. So our number one that's Big Seven by Banner Boy. Let's have that and we'll be coming back with the video premiere. Fresh and clean. Yes, you're still watching Fresh and Clean, only only 24 television. I don't know who I should. Let me start from him. Do you have money? Um, Are you stingy or not? I'm not stingy at all. Okay, introduce yourself. Um, my name is, I, I'm Jack Ma. Yes, I'm Jack Ma. Mm. And we, together we, we are the Good Vibes Music. Okay. 
Yes. Jack Maba. Sajja baina amanya mu muchali eyo musempe osimanyi je tunalagana mmwe. Introduce yourself. My name is uh, Octin Smith. Wano wetula ga mufachi nisi. What does Octin Smith mean? Octin. Mm, just Octin. Okay, Smith I know it's a name. Octin to me means vocal. Vocal. Okay. Well, me I'm Shiba, so I think we are going to have a, a, a trio. Okay. Be singing three of us. <laughs> you have a Shiba with you guys. Um, uh, before you go into singing, I will ask him a question. I also wanted to ask you for the ladies. Do you have money? Yeah. Are you stingy? I'm not. Okay. Let's leave that. Um, aside singing, what do you guys do? Because they told me one of you guys is a doctor. Ningamba, omusawo, t-shirt wa gaza, what kuwe mpisota yimba, mu what's up? Baba limba. Are you the doctor? Because to me, the way you're dressed, like, it seems like you're the doctor. Of course, I don't look like one. <laughs> I don't look like one. Um, two years ago, we live in Mugwanga, Uganda, and we're going to be a But are you a doctor? I'm not. Are you the doctor? I'm not. So they told me they told me one of you guys is a doctor and I want to confirm. Mm. Uh, 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 okay. Um Alright. When do you guys start singing? Um uh, okay. The duo the duo is like one month ago. Actually we have we we released our video like in two weeks, three weeks back. Yes, so the duo just started, but twali to imbabia fe, buriomunga imbabia, but we combined to making us something good. And I'm going to do a little bit of my name, Vidi, Natalina, Vidi, Alicam, Natalicam, Catalica, Guatalicam. And is it? I didn't know. Are you serious? I come, Catty. No. <laughs> you guys, what do you think? Who do you think is the come one? I feel like he's the come one, and this one is. I'm a stubbornist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how did you guys come to, to join yourselves together? Were you singing alone before? Yeah, just okay. as you said, that mm. we used to be separate and yes. then you joined. As singles, then yeah. finally we made a, a duet. How did you how did you say my young amba? Eh, guy, you know, music, I think we can connect. How did, how did you come up with that? Finally, it was just an idea. Mm. What if? Finally, what if came to reality? Meaning, you guys were friends before? Uh, just as you know, in the music industry, mm. then, then finally comes as an idea. I tell you, you look like gift of Kado. Am I the first person to say it? You're the first person. I tell you, you look like gift of Kado. Am I the first person to say it? You're the first person. I tell you, you look like gift of Kado. Am I the first person to Tell me about your new song that you're here at Premier. Yeah. Um, I want, uh, that song is called Omani. Mm. Uh, it is done by Nassim okay. himself. Uh, the director is the, uh, Edwin Paul. Mm. Uh, it is a good song. It has some good message, by the way. Is it Pe about love? It is not love this time. Mm, it's about what? It is about life. Okay. Yeah. So mm. it is some good song. People, uh, like people, different people can use it in different ways. Mm. Yes, because it has some good message. Okay. Um, I see on the song you have. I see on the song you have like top top people who worked on it. We have Nesim, we have Edwin Paul, and these are big people. How do you come up with them? And do you have? Do you guys have a management? No, we don't have a management. But finding people, it's all about connection. Yeah. You see me too. I did not come direct to you, but I passed through someone. Yeah. So. Finding those people, it's through connection. So. Okay. Mm. All right. So we are going to take a, sh a quick break, and then when you come back, you're going to be finding out more about that duo that I have with me right now. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Yes, you're still watching Fresh and Clean, and I have a duo with me right now. They've been telling us about themselves. Their names. They're going to introduce them to their names again, because Munai. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, my name is again Jack Ma. Jack Ma. Yes, okay. Jack Ma. And then Octin Smith. Octin Smith. Okay. I don't know. Following at So, the song you're premiering right now, 
how did you guys come to write it? What inspired you and all that? We just wanted to write about reality. Yeah. And uh, there, there are very many cases of reality. But uh, this time we chose um, Kwandika Kumbera ya Montunaitao. Mm. So, according to director Ngeri Jaya Chile Tamu, he mm. director Chile in the form of Katutugambe Nti Mukozi. Mm. Akumanyi, like Abira Wakao, so Akumanyi Nyo, mm. that form, Mwaya Chile Tila, in a director. All right. Um, before, before we bring in the video premiere, I want to ask you something. Mm. iPhone or Nokia? I'm asking you, I'm okay. not thinking speed. <laughs> I'm, not iPhone think. or Nokia. I'm not thinking, but mm. what I'm saying is mm. we start from Nokia, then mm. we up upgrade to iPhone. So, I, which phone are you using right now? I, I, iPhone. iPhone or Nokia? iPhone. Shiba or Cindy? <laughs> Shiba or Cindy? Both of them. <laughs> <laughs> You can show the guys a cool concert. We're gonna go away with them. We really, you, you, you're going to be in two places at the same time. But All right. Um, where do we find your music? Your social media platforms. Yes, all platforms. Good vibes music. Yeah, YouTube everywhere actually. Okay. All platforms. Yes. Um, in case someone wants to book you for maybe a wedding, birthday, school event, number jamu tua. Number nanti kati. Mm. But uh, you know, we eat the one because someone may be there and they want to invite you guys. And the buyer would they work again on Instagram, but she mm. Mm. still they can go through contacts. Contacts, and get it to China management into a mina quita, a holy or the other syndicate. Okay, it's good. Most, pe most people who'd love who'd like, like to work with us, over mm. money, Edwin Po. Mm. Uh, U24, mm. you cannot fail to get us. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, you said YouTube it's Good Vibes Music. Good. All right. Please make sure you go on there. YouTube that's Good Vibes Music. You subscribe. Use their song on TikTok as a challenge and use the hashtag Good Vibes Music. And I'm pretty sure we are going to grow them. Here on Trend for Television, we're all about growing the young talent. This is the fresh duo in the, in the industry. So let's support them, grow their music. And love one another. Let's have the music, the music video, and we'll be coming back to sign out. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Fresh and clean. Yes, we have come. Wow, but that's it. Yes, we have come to the end of this amazing episode. It has been fresh and clean. It has been hosted by yours truly, Shibai Jofo. Please follow me on my Instagram. That's at Shibai Jofo on Instagram. And then TikTok, Shibai Jofo still. Please make sure you follow me on my TikTok. Follow me. I always see you guys leaving comments. Is it I just saw you on TV? Thank you guys so much for always giving us that feedback. It's good to do something and then people are appreciating what people are seeing it. So that's what I always tell you when you go on our YouTube, please make sure you leave a comment down there. That's at Fresh and Clean. Make sure you make sure you subscribe to it. Share it all your friends. Instagram Fresh and Clean, TikTok Fresh and Clean. A short reminder before I go, as we, as we are into the last month of there, please make sure you're keeping safe and making enough money for december because when it comes to december we are spending it and then aside that make sure you're good you're a good person you being a good person doesn't take away anything from you yes the world doesn't favor every good person but then at the end of the day you always rip something out of it you rip what you saw be kind love one another spread love to one another and take care of yourselves we are out peace Fresh and clean.